Hi there, welcome to the Reynolds Report. Time for me to bring you the leaders in the race for the MVP award, the most valuable player in the NFL. We're approaching the halfway point of the season, so there's a long way to go, and this award uh, can be won with a sprint to the finish. But at number five, he's been a constant uh, on their defense all year long. Calais Campbell at defensive end for the Jacksonville Jaguars. Just a giant of a man, an impossible defender to block and a great locker room leader. So this is normally an award that goes to an offensive player, primarily quarterback, but Calais Campbell is on this list uh, for now. At number four is Kareem Hunt, the rookie running back of the Kansas City Chiefs. He's averaging 143 yards from scrimmage per game. He averages a big play or two every game. He's explosive. He does it in the running game and the passing game. Uh, so Kareem Hunt is at number four on my list. At number three is this young lad called Tom Brady. You might have heard of him. He's looking pretty good for the New England Patriots. And I feel like the Patriots are rounding into form. Not that Tom needed to round into form. He was been uh, playing at a high level from the start of this season. It's all been about the defense catching up to him. So uh, Brady, I think by the end of the year, he might get Super Bowl number six. How's that going to sit with the rest of the NFL? They're not going to enjoy that one. Uh, number two uh, remains Alex Smith. I think Alex Smith, although the Chiefs have lost twice in five days uh, to go from 5-0 and oh to 5-2, and two, I feel like Alex Smith is still holding up his end of the bargain. He's playing more adventurous football than he ever has. Uh, very efficient. He's a great athlete. He can hurt you with his legs and his arms. So, you know, Alex Smith and the Chiefs will be there or thereabouts at the end of the year. And uh, number one... Uh, on my list. He broke into the top five last time we did this, uh, but he shot all the way from number five to number one is Carson Wentz of the Philadelphia Eagles. The Eagles have the best record in the NFL and Carson Wentz has grown tremendously from year one to year two. He's has more command of the offense. It helps he's being better protected. He's got better receivers, but he's not only got a strong arm and an accurate arm, he's a little Houdini. If you watch him escape the pressure of the Washington Redskins on Monday Night Football. It's wonderful to see what he does in the pocket. So Carson Wentz, you're leading the way, kid. Keep it up.